Hello and welcome. This is Mel Skinner, and we're back with some more Mech Warrior 3. We're ready to go, so let's launch up. All right. Take a look at these. Oh. oh wow, that guy's pretty close. Ooh. Get going. See if we can dodge these successfully. Good. Probably gonna need to get ready to dodge again. Okay. Successful again. Okay, we got a good opportunity here. Behind him. Alright. So far, so good. dead all right that was uh interesting little uh fight to start off with um let's go ahead get repaired i didn't take too much damage but my ally may have let's see yeah a little bit and he expended probably quite a bit of damage i probably could keep going but i see a lot of enemy contacts here so why not I got a little bit of a... This gives me an opportunity to actually read my objectives now. Okay. So destroy docking station at Abel. Destroy enemy headquarters at Baker. Destroy the forces. And then destroy truck convoy. I'll have to take a look at that in a second. Maybe that's what all those contacts are that are nearby. We'll see. I'll look while uh, my ally gets ready to repair. So uh, let's see what these contacts are. Yeah, so that's a truck there. Got a tank, truck, truck, tank, turret. Okay. The two tanks, two turrets. Uh, those are off over that way though, and uh, they haven't said anything. Yet. Seeming they're not ready. I hope they didn't sit. I probably shouldn't move ahead because there's probably mechs that are powered down. Huh. What the? Okay, disengaging. Waiting try that again. Rendezvous coordinates. Try that again. Roger that, Lance Leader. Transferring now. They have to actually say they're ready. For them to be able to do the repairs. Not saying anything. Well, we could try. I don't think that they're ready, though. See what happens when I tell them to repair. My way to repair a vehicle. Going. Maybe glitching out because of the train, because there's kind of the slope here. And he just walked over there and then nothing's happening. So I'm gonna assume something's up here. Let's uh let's grab him. Tell him to come back to me. Um we'll give him one more try. But I may have to tell them to go somewhere else before they actually work here. I mean it worked the one time. Try again. Waiting for rendezvous coordinates. Roger that, Lance Leader. Transferring now. Give them like a 10 count. If they don't set up, then... I'm going to assume that they're not going to. It's somewhat problematic. Yeah, alright. Let's just go ahead. If they eventually say that they're ready, then we'll use them. But meantime, hopefully my ally doesn't get shot up. Detected. 
Okay, kind of expected that. Okay, looks like the trucks are going for a run. Let's hit them. So they don't get away. Um, I'm gonna ignore that mech. I'm doing a very good job of hitting what I'm trying to shoot at. Got one more. Okay. Now let's turn to face him. I don't know what shot a missile at me, but I'm gonna try and dodge it. Okay, it looks like I successfully did so. I'm trying to get my ally into this fight. They were nowhere near. This guy's just running away. Coming back around though. You know what? There's uh, those turrets. Let's hit them from here. Yeah, he's gonna let me do this, I'll do it. The other one's here. Yeah. I still haven't heard anything from the targeting. What the okay, disengaging. Let's see if we can do whatever objective we're supposed to do here. But I got a target there, which my AI ally is hitting. Oh. Okay. On. Then we got another one here. Alright, I think the AI is... Wait. Back around. There he is. Dodge that. Oh, not quite. You need help, I'm the one getting hit. Alright, he's dead. Targeting. Okay, we got some elementals. Let's see if the uh yeah, they can set up in here. Let's see if they'll set up properly in here. Try and snipe these guys. My ally is probably running low on ammo. He's sitting in back there. It's something I could target here. Let's hit that. Maybe that's something that has to do with an objective. Ooh, uh, another thing here. Can I target? Oh, there's a target. Oh, we'll hit the objective while we wait for the mobile field base. I'm going to send my ally in this time first. I mean, if I can't repair, that'd be kind of a problem because my one leg shot up a bit, but... Assuming that elemental somewhere I can't hit it. I don't have a targeter. Okay, well, it sounds like they're on the way. Let's try and get a little bit out of their way. Targeting. 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 Oh, that one mech's gone. I don't even have it on radar Targeting. anymore. Looks like they're set up. There we go. There. I don't want to go too far in because there may be mech power ups. Targeting. Targeting. You guys are definitely in a spot I can't hit them from. There's something I could hit here. There it is. Or there was something I'd, I could lock on here. Did I already do it? Hold on. 
Oh yeah, I already killed that. I forgot. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can do my repair now. Waiting for rendezvous coordinates. Roger that way. It's using more level train, probably there they, that other area was a problem. Yeah, deploy. that was almost immediate. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna assume that's what it was. It was just a weird train. Easier for them if they have flat. I don't know where that one mech went. Guess we'll find out. Might be able to ignore the elementals if they're not really... They're gonna, you know, hide somewhere. Alright, let's go. It's kind of weird, though. That one mech was there, and then it just... Not there anymore. I mean, maybe it ran off? I don't know. Or maybe it powered down? There he is. Medium in range of my medium. Oh. Touch it. Nope. Oh, he's, he's dead right there. I don't know what happened to him. Maybe when I blew up that one building, it blew him up? I'm not really sure. Weird, though. All right. Get going. Looks like this is the way to go. As a matter of fact, let's switch to objective. So what's the last one we have? Power up detected. Kill the forces. All right. Targeting. Black Hawk? Hurry. I mean, I think that was the only enemy. Mech power up detected. Targeting. Okay. I said to blow those tanks. I want to report to that effect. Get the base. No, hopefully this is the only guy, because the I think the tanks are right here. We gotta go to Charlie. Not really sure which way I'm supposed to go. Okay. Yeah, okay. Seems right. Am I supposed to shoot it? Oh, no, let's be careful here. That might be what controls the tanks. I don't think this is it. Even though I'm, like, right on top. Ah! I'm all confused at which way I'm turned. There I go. Maybe follow the road. I was going to say, I almost probably shot the thing, the thing that would have killed me. Little confused where I'm supposed to go. Am I already done? Oh. Okay, so Op Charlie, elevator. All right, we'll get over there. I really hope that if I shoot this, it doesn't blow up and kill me. But... We're still 72 meters away, so that's, this has to be a door, right? All right. Oof. 
Okay. Apologize for that confusion, but I didn't want to accidentally kill myself. What? Living. Okay, there we go. Shoo. Mission successful. Yay! All right. Now they're willing to kill their own workers to get at us. Whatever happened to the old clan idea of honorable combat? This Ratachosis is feeling the pressure from above. Okay, still no word from Epona Reed. She may be just under radio silence. Also, Keith Andrew has given up on trying to press north for rendezvous with the Eclipse's commando teams. The clan presence is too strong. He's working his way south along the edge of Operations Area 3. Okay, this is a very good weapon system. I hope I have, I think I already have one. I just hope I have actual ammo for it now. 30 rounds, see, that's just not enough. I mean, you gave me two weapon systems and you gave me 30 rounds. That's nothing. I go through that in a, a single mission. So we're still a little bit of a problem as far as ammunition goes. Uh, we did get some more Streak SRM-6, though. That's good. AC-2, we have a uh, huge amount of that. Now, did we get any mechs? I didn't look. Got a Thor. All right, well, now we finally have a heavy mech. That's good. Okay. Run probe data. This looks to be an easy run. I think we can use that right about now. This is where we just exited. It needs to be closed permanently. Your next target is this structure at Op Point Baker. Freeze video. Intel suggests that this is the main distribution point for materials from the underground facility. It should contain some good salvage. Run video. Freeze video. The entrance to the next underground site is here. Here are your objectives. Eliminate the elevator shaft at Abel. Neutralize the barracks warehouse area at Baker. And our final rendezvous will be at Op Point Charlie. We don't have any information on fixed emplacements, which doesn't mean that there aren't any. The Jaguars know we're here. And judging from radio traffic, we're approaching the actual mech factory. Ratash Osis is especially furious, but we've kept a step ahead of them so far. We'll continue to monitor communications. All right. Take a look at salvage. Now, we're probably approaching that point where we're going to run out a tonnage here, but I'll take everything, see what we get. Uh, easy thing to get rid of this stage is uh, AC2 ammo because we have a lot of that. Uh, also, machine gun ammo. Uh, is something we can get rid of fairly easily. Uh, but I'm going to take everything. And we'll see where we're at. But we are getting kind of close. I'm going to skip over the AZ-2 for now. And the machine gun. Although that's not a lot of machine Okay. Looks like we can maybe get away with it. I mean, the armor is going to be... Hey, finally we got a standard heatsink. And a standard double heatsink. Non-clan. Cool. Alright. Looks like we can get away with it, so I'll go ahead and grab all the... But very soon, I'm going to have to start dumping things. Alright. Mech Lab. Uh, without a shadow of a doubt, I'm going to a Thor. Mobile mechs are good and everything, but... So far, what we've been seeing with this game is a habit of throwing a lot of enemies at you and a lot of heavier enemies at you. Without armor, I'm going to have the, you know, it's just going to be kind of hard from a standpoint of we might die. So let's see what we've got. Um, so all of these say incomplete, so it's possible. Just say no. Go with the primary, that's fine. So, customize. Get rid of the, the case for now until we know. We've got LBX ammo that we might not be using. We've got jump jets installed. Uh, that's probably fine. It's, it's already probably the maximum as well. We'll find out, honestly. We could try. Uh, let's go to the center torso. And we'll go to jump jets. See if it will let me install more. Nope, four. Funny how we have more jump jets in this thing than we did a lighter mech, but that's just the way it kind of times goes, I guess. All right, uh, this is a 70-ton mech. We have a lot of tonnage to work with. 
Uh, we are rocking in normal internal structure. So we could get more tonnage by using in the, the endo steel. We have extra light engine, so that's fine. Um, what are we doing armor wise? We've got the clan one. Um, probably could fit more in. 11 tons, that's pretty good. And. Nine points. Go with there, there. You know, it's not that far from getting maxed out. Um, not the maximum point. There. Up. Go to twenty-eight. Now we have seven points. Okay. I'm a little unhappy with the left. So here, maybe we go down to six. Up to twenty. Go up to four here. All right, that's what I'm gonna go for. So we don't want to get hit in the rear, obviously. Oh, well, this should have full torso twist and everything. That's good. We have 28 criticals available. We might not actually need all that. Um, ammunition. Let's take a look at this. We have a lot of AC2 ammo. That much I'm already aware of. The uh, LB-10X is, is a good weapon, but I only have 40 shots. It's not very good. I do have an LB-2X, which we have 150 shots. I almost want to see something about like using the AC2. We already have that in my ally with the uh, the bushwhacker, but just from a standpoint of ammunition, I just want to use what I have ammo for. I do have a lot of LRM5 ammo, so we could be doing that, but the AC2 should be a fairly long range. I, I don't have the manuals and stuff in front of me, so I don't know exactly what kind of range it's going to have, but it should be one of the longer range weapons uh, in the game. So you might be able to take advantage of that. We already have 14 double heat sinks. Uh, AC2 shouldn't generate much heat at all, so in that regard, we'd be fine. Um, what we might do is just, I don't know what kind of reload time they have. I've never used an AC2 ever, so what I might do is uh, do a loadout and then maybe do like a test run just to see how AC2s run. As a matter of fact, because I'm not sure how this is going to work, I think I'm going to go ahead and just wrap up the video here. Um, We'll see about the the AC2, how effective it is, what would be the ideal for how many of them I would want to install, and we'll go from there. But in any case, I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. This is Mouse Gunner, signing out.